There are calls to ban a pesticide with links to Parkinson's disease. Paraquat is already under review by the Pesticides Authority, but scientists warn that many more people could get sick while a decision is being made. Kieran McKechnie has the story. It's a herbicide used extensively in agriculture, but the move is on to try to ban paraquat. The use of chemicals is important in agriculture, we know that, but we've got to make sure that those that have got a bad reputation aren't used. Paraquat has such a bad reputation, it's banned in 32 countries, including across Europe and parts of Southeast Asia. Scientists say the chemical has known links to Parkinson's disease. Once you've got Parkinson's, you've lost a certain number of brain cells in a particular area of the brain related to movement. A number of chemicals like um, Paraquat, Maneb, um, Rotenone, all target those cells and destroy them. Parkinson's Australia is now planning a national campaign to force the Commonwealth to act. It's warning the federal government it could face compensation claims if it doesn't. That's certainly part of the, the questions that we have to raise with government. Where there's smoke, there's fire. The Australian Pesticides and Veterinary Medicines Authority admits Paraquat has been under review since 1997, but its investigations are still ongoing. As it makes up its mind, scientists are urging better education about the dangers. And lots of farmers have got huge sheds full of drums of this, and you know, it has to be... If it was me, I'd be gowned and I'd be gloves and goggles and masks because it's, all these chemicals are toxic. The evidence is growing day by day. So, he says, is the incidence of Parkinson's in farming communities. Kieran McKechnie, Lateline.